Bisschen weird. Jungle Book today, which I'm super stoked about because it's supposed to be a masterpiece. Ella uh, and I've got Crow all excited, and we're going with uh, we're going to Grandma Patty. We're supposed to leave in 15 minutes, and let me just show you where the boys are right now. One. Wakey wakey, it's time to go see the Jungle Book. We have to leave in 15 minutes. It's time to wake up. Good morning. Wake up, wake up. We have to leave, we have to go. <laughs> wake up. Hey, wake up. <laughs> it's time to go see the Jungle Book. You ready to go to the movies? Yeah. Oh my daddy. You got your jungle book shirt on? Yeah. You have to get How daddy are you awake. awake right now. How are you even awake? You're just knocked out. <laughs> Tell daddy it's time to go see the movie. Let's go back to sleep. No, no, stay here. No. Let's stay in bed. No, 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 Wake up, sleepy head. Walk. Yeah. Hey, hi! Hello! We're going to the movies! What are we gonna see? Yeah! Give me a kiss. Love you. Mwah! Are you ready? We got your goodies because we have to keep them with you. Take care of those animals. Right? Paprika rub chicken with barley, tomatoes, and avocado salad. This company, Hello Fresh, they send you three meals and it's all fresh, totally fresh produce. It sounded like a lot of fun and a great concept. So we were like, yeah, let's try this out. That looks like a perfect lunch dish. Yeah, it does. 30 minutes, it's nut free. It's level one and dairy free. The whole meal takes 30 minutes. You have that, you cook the rest while that's you know simmering. Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. They perfectly measure out the right amount of ingredients for each thing. It eliminates all waste, which is pretty great because how many times do you go shopping to make one meal and you have to buy more stuff than you need and you end up with a ton of waste? You smell it? Smell it. What is that from? Easier. So you choose which meal boxes you want and then they just send them to your door. So we had this big box of all this fresh food just at our doorstep when we got home the other day. Pretty convenient because the worst thing ever is going to the grocery store. For us, this was a super convenient, like, actual great way for us to get healthy, easy meals. And we were pretty stoked about it. So we were able to team up with them, go to their website and put in our promo code, which is MattBlue, and you'll get 40 bucks off your first week. So another cool thing is with all their products that they send you, that makes it it's all, you can source everything to where it's come from. So like both the meats, so the chicken and the steak came from Denver, Colorado. Get that elbow up. That up, up real high. This? <laughs> yeah. You're dripping juice everywhere. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> I accidentally spilled the balsamic on mine. <laughs> I hope I like balsamic. I'm glad I didn't ask you to put mine. Ta-da! 
Alright, so it's my brother's birthday, and he's really into these plants right now, and since we're so obsessed with plants, that's what we're going to get him for his birthday. I'm trying to track down this one particular kind of plant that he wants, like a lady slipper, and it's some sort of succulent. I'm back at the nursery that we were at the other day. I'm hoping that they'll have one, because his birthday's tonight. Well, they have it. They don't look very lively. This is kind of a sad plan. I can't just give this for his birthday present. Mm. So no luck at the nursery. I think we're gonna hit up Home Depot. Mikey may just be getting a pot and not a lady slipper. Apparently lady slippers are a little bit difficult to track down right now. All right, I think we're gonna go with this guy. We'll let Crow get a little creative on this pot. This kind of looks like his lady slipper. It's long and green beanie. I hope he likes it. Oh, I'm gonna have to drive so carefully. This is make me so nervous. This is Mikey's final product, his birthday present. Crow, as you can see, helped paint the pot. He also ha helped plant it, which made it a little uneven, but it has character. Happy birthday, brother. I hope you like your very messy pot and new plant. <laughs> And this one says, make me first. It's shrimp and chorizo paella. Let's get cooking. Hi, I'm Matt Dallas, and I have my ears pierced. Check out my hoops. This is a very, very beautiful ear piercing, Lucifer. Look, this is, I'm gonna make this shit right here. Shrimp and chorizo paella with smoked paprika, tomatoes, and peas. Let's make this. <laughs> Jeez, with the coughing while I'm trying to talk to, to these beautiful people at home. Hey, that's my mask. This is gonna take me 45 minutes. It's nut free, it's a level three, and it's gluten free. All right, what do I gotta do first? Prep the ingredients. Good thing I have fruit and vegetable wash. What are you doing? <laughs> you want a piece of onion? Oh. Is that delicious? Ah. That smells good. I got my paella simmering. Look, it's so colorful and tasty. We're about to add some shrimp. Mmm. Some shrimp are in. And just like that, look at those beautiful paellas. Nom, 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 it's nom, so nom, nom. Let's see. Blue couldn't even wait. When my brother and I were little, we used to have our own rooms. I had these yellow bunk beds. He had a water bed. I would sleep in his room every night in his water bed because I didn't want to sleep in my room alone and I wanted to be with my brother. It's funny because I'm the older brother. Shouldn't it be like he wants to sleep in my room? But we were really close when we were little. When we started to approach middle school, he was very athletic and really into sports and I was not. We kind of started to like go our different ways and we lived in the same house and we always got along, especially at family functions. We were always together and got along really well, but we had just had such separate lives. It's just been interesting now as an adult, and especially as we, since we've come back to Phoenix, how my relationship with my brother has, we've kind of come back together because we have now, I guess as adults, we have more common interests. And it's been one of my favorite things about returning or coming, but moving back to Phoenix is the, my relationship with my brother. Happy birthday, go Mikey! Oh, I love that he plays with my hair. I love that. Love that. Okay, we're walking 